Good morning, students. Our today's topic is redox reaction. The word redox is made up of two more terms. Red means reduction and ox means oxidation. So first of all, we should know that what are the oxidation and reduction. Oxidation can be defined as addition of oxygen or any electronegative element to a substance that is called the oxidation or we can say that if in any reaction removal of hydrogen or removal of electropositive element is there then that reaction is also called oxidation reaction. Next is reduction. Reduction is just opposite of the oxidation means if we have any reaction in which removal of oxygen or removal of electronegative element is there then that reaction is reduction or we can say the addition of hydrogen or addition of electropositive element is there then also this reaction is called reduction. Now I will explain you this with the help of this example. Look at this reaction. Students in this reaction carbon dioxide is reacting with the hydrogen gas and we are getting two product that is the carbon monoxide and water right. So now see the equation before reaction carbon is attached with the two oxygen means that is the carbon dioxide but after reaction we are getting the carbon monoxide in which carbon has only one oxygen. So in this conversion we can see the removal of oxygen. So this reaction is reduction. So carbon dioxide is reducing over here. In second reactant which is hydrogen you can see that after the reaction hydrogen is getting attached with the oxygen and converted into water. So here we can see the addition of oxygen. So this reaction is oxidation. So hydrogen is oxidizing here. Now next our term is oxidizing and reducing agents. Oxidizing agents cause oxidation and reducing agent cause reduction. Look at this equation. Now in this equation copper oxide reacts with the hydrogen and giving the products copper and water. Now in this reaction copper oxide is losing or removing the oxygen after the reaction. So in this reaction copper oxide is reducing and it is acting as a oxidizing agent. Correct? Now look at the second reactant hydrogen. Hydrogen is getting oxygen after the reaction. So hydrogen is oxidizing and it is acting as a reducing agent. So student you can easily learn this thing if any compound or substance is getting reduction or reducing then itself it is a oxidizing agent and if any substance or element or compound is oxidizing then definitely it is acting as a reducing agent.